there are waffles. Then there are grand Belgian waffles, those amazing thick delicacies with deep patterns that hold syrups, nuts, fruits, and other delicious toppings. These are not the kind of waffles most people can make at home until now. The secret is the rotation. The Proline Waffle Baker can make two grand Belgian waffles in less than five minutes. These are gourmet-style waffles that measure more than seven inches in diameter and more than an inch thick. The clamshell baking unit rotates to coat the upper and lower waffle plates evenly. Your waffles are golden crisp outside while the inside remains soft. The digital countdown timer eliminates guesswork so that you get splendid, perfect results every time. Push the on-off button to on. When your waffle baker reaches baking temperature, the blinking light becomes steady. You'll hear a message tone, and the dial thermometer shows ready. Set the waffle timer by rotating the timer adjustment dial. A good starting time is about 3 minutes 30 seconds. Use your favorite batter. The waffle plates have a non-stick surface, so there is no need to coat the plates with oil or use a non-stick spray. Use a non-metallic ladle and spatula to avoid damaging the non-stick surfaces of the waffle plates or a pouring pitcher. Close the lid. Rotate the baking unit even if you make only one waffle. Rotation coats the upper and lower plate on each side. Press the start button. In just a few minutes, you'll have a perfect creation. If you start to remove the waffle and decide you want it darker and crisper, just close the lid and wait a bit. Once you have a perfect waffle, you can adjust the time needed to bake the next batch of waffles. Press the reset button as you remove the waffle to reset the timer and you're ready for the next waffle. Keep in the heat by closing the lid after removing each waffle. When you set up your ProLine Waffle Baker, you should make two waffles to season the plates. Discard these first two waffles. Sometimes, materials used in the normal manufacturing process flavor these first waffles. Now you're ready to make perfect waffles. Dial more time for browner, crisper waffles, less time for waffles that are lighter and softer. When you are finished making waffles, unplug the unit, wait for the waffle baker to cool, and wipe with a soft, damp, clean cloth. That's all the cleaning it needs. Grand Belgian waffles should not be stacked or placed on a solid surface. You can keep finished waffles warm by placing them in a single layer in a warming drawer or in a 200 degree oven for up to 15 minutes. Try using a pitcher instead of a ladle. Some chefs find it much easier to pour than to try and control the drips from a ladle. For extra fluffy waffles with recipes that call for eggs, separate the yolks and beat the whites until fluffy, then add them back into the mix just before baking. Don't overmix the batter. A few lumps are fine. Smooth batters make tough waffles. If waffles stick, try a little more butter or oil in the recipe. Do not use shortening, oil, non-stick sprays, or other non-stick coatings on the plates. Waffles are so versatile that they can be used for times other than breakfast. There are several recipe suggestions in your owner's manual, including an idea for savory waffles that make wonderful appetizers.